Hello everyone! I've gone too far the other way now. I've gone too dark. That's better. How are we all? So I have to apologise in advance because it looks like I'm going to be looking at the wrong screen for a while. <laughs> because for some reason, I don't know whether if I kind of switch cameras to different screens, whether that's actually going to make much of a difference. Sometimes it does, sometimes it doesn't. So if I... No, it's still looking like... Yeah, I'm going to be looking directly at you when I'm looking at the game. That's fine. It's fine. Oh my lord, this is kind of not how I expected this to look. Um... Oh no, I don't want you... I don't want you to... I didn't... I didn't want that. Right, there we go. Let's try that. I keep a bopping alert on. You see, the problem is now I've gone too far the other way. Right, what's going on with my camera? I need to move my camera a little bit because obviously I am now on the other side. So... Other way. There we go. There we go. Okay, that's better. Oh my lord. Okay, this is kind of not what I was expecting. What I wanted to do... Okay, that's a bit weird. Um, I just wanted to like get rid. I didn't want to put the things in. I just, I wanted to put the... I wanted to put the edges pieces, like, so they were just on top i didn't i didn't think it was going to i didn't think it was going to do that oh lord this is going to take ages oh, well, never mind. I, do, I do love me a good a good jigsaw there we go i'll tell you what zoom out a little bit more i don't like the fact that's how you move the camera that makes me feel anxious um yeah all i wanted to do was just kind of like not so much put all the things out but just kind of get rid of all of the non-corner pieces position corner pieces zoom out Because I didn't really want to have to individually do it. Oh. Okay, the, the the camera controls on this is are a little bit wonky. Okay, I'll tell you what I'll do for now. Let me just put anything that's a that's a, a corner piece, uh, an edge piece. I kind of got the inspiration to do this from my friend because we we were talking about repicking up things, and he was saying that he had jigsaw puzzles, and he loves he loves jigsaw puzzles. Um, so I, I encouraged him to start that up, um, and then I looked on these these free games that I downloaded, and I was like, oh, I've got a jigsaw puzzle myself. Why don't I do what I told him to do?" And okay, I'm gonna have to change the back. Uh, the background of it for particularly this one because I that's better because the other one being as dark as it was meant that I couldn't I can't realistically see okay. I think if I yeah there we go let's just but yeah, so we, um, hopefully everybody's day is going well. It is Sunday today, my dudes. And I hope your Sunday's been a nice one. We had a nice Sunday. We went to, uh, uh, we met up with some friends. And, uh, went to a little play park. And, uh, finally introduced our kids to each other. <laughs> Which sounds weird when you phrase it like that. 
Um, but basically, we, we haven't seen each other since um, COVID. And um, one of them, like, they, they've all had children through one way or another. And therefore, we've just been like, ah, we've not seen each other. Let, let's all meet up. Um, oh, okay. Accidentally joined two together. That's fine. Um, so, yeah, it was, it was just really nice to be able to have that time where we could all meet up, introduce the kids. They got on really well. So that was really nice. I kind of like the music in this. But yeah, so I came back and was talking to my friend and he's, he's kind of going through a bit of a rough patch at the moment. So it, it was nice to be able to kind of like give him a much needed kick up the big backside and uh, end up accidentally giving myself uh, something to stream at the same time. Because I know I said that I would be looking at doing uh, Animal Crossing today, but I haven't actually got the Animal Crossing thing plugged in. And sometimes I just can't be bothered to dig underneath my computer to go and do it. So, yeah, it's fine. I was like, maybe I should do lesser ones. And I was like, ah, you know what? No. See, because the thing that I would normally do is I would kind of put them all on top of each other. Um, and I just kind of get the feeling that's not really going to work with this one. <laughs> but what I am also trying to do is uh, I'm trying to get sides sorted. And then I can probably, like, zoom out a little bit more. Oh, why is that the way that works, though? I really don't like the fact that's the way that works. And then I can kind of... Like, I do appreciate the fact that you can kind of... Okay, so this one goes on edge. Well, you can zoom out. So that can kind of be where you get your stuff from. But at the same time, I kind of don't appreciate it at the same time. But yeah, so this is steampunk. Steampunk puzzles. And that's the trick. They're just steampunking looking things and I like the fact that you can have the picture underneath if you feel like that would be more beneficial to you um I haven't played it before today so I, uh, I am just as lost as you can probably tell oh those two are joined that's handy um let me get all these edges out all these uh, non edges I should say and then if you kind of like sort some of this out because like i said ordinarily i'd kind of like pile them all together but i don't really want to do that with this because i get the feeling that once it gets because there's like 700 pieces so i kind of get the feeling that once it gets too far in um yeah it's not really gonna work out Oh, no, that's an edge. Keep that in there. Do or not. I haven't, I haven't done like an actual genuine puzzle, like a jigsaw, in a really, really long time. And I do love, I do love me some jigsaws. Can't wait till Isaac's a little bit older and how. I mean, like he he kind of has jigsaw puzzles now, but he doesn't really have the patience for them. So he just kind of keeps wanting to sh just shove everything in and just be like, yeah, that'll do. And it's like, no. And then it gets frustrated when he can't do that. And it's like, baby, just have a little bit of patience. Have a little bit of, like, thought about what you're doing. Have a look at it. But he is only three, so, you know. I get it. He wants things done there and then. He doesn't want to wait. 
I get that. And for a three-year-old, waiting is one of the most difficult things you'll ever do. You will never, ever, ever do anything more complicated than waiting for something that you really, really don't want to wait for. And I appreciate that. I have to remember sometimes that I was a child and sometimes I can get really impatient with things. So one thing that I was contemplating doing, um, just kind of on on the back of this and, and hobbies and things, is um, so I cross-stitch as a hobby. I know, I am such an old lady. Um, but I don't know. I was kind of thinking maybe I, I might cross stitch, uh, on stream for a little, like maybe one, one day a week. I don't know though. I guess I kind of need more people in to find out whether that's something that actually people are going to watch. <laughs> That's the thing. Is it gonna be something people watch? I don't know. It's 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 more so I'll actually just do it. Cause that uh, it's it's kind of the point I've got to at the moment. Isn't it's not the fact that. I don't want to do it. It's the fact that I don't have the time, and um, I Isaac is particularly at the moment very much into wanting to copy whatever I'm doing. So he tries to help <laughs> in the way kids often like to help their parents, and uh, anyone who's got kids will know. They don't help when they think they're helping. <laughs> they really think they are. They they really they really do think they're helping. They're really not, bless them. They're really not. So the amount that he has almost messed up. And I'm like, I can't really be angry at him because it's not very fair. You know, it, it's an interest. It may be something that he wants to get into when he's older. I don't really want to put him off it. But at the same time, I'm kind of like, oh, please don't ruin my cross stitch. Um, but I did find some old stuff, uh, like spares that I used to have. Um, they, they're kind of like leftovers from other projects that I've done. Um, so yeah, I, I kind of just donated. I brought him his own set as well. But yeah, I, I, do, I donated um a load of stuff to him which made me feel happy because i didn't feel quite so bad i didn't feel like i was just sh like scaring him off wanting to do it because i was like that's really not what i want to do like if he wants to do if he wants to take this up as a hobby i'd be thrilled because you know i can teach him some of the the tips and tricks that i've learned <laughs> but at the same time he's not wrecking my projects you know I've, I've been more than happy to help him with his own okay. Okay, let's start putting another layer in I think it's probably like a really long-winded way of doing it but I didn't want to cheat by just putting all the corners in I was like, I felt like that was that was cheating just a bit too much. Oh, no, you can stay in that. I felt like that was cheating just a little bit too much, and I didn't want to do that. Okay. <laughs> we are getting there. 
I do like the fact they give you this little side section, probably because they know that logistically you're going to be doing something similar to this. Okay. Ah, no. Come back here, yo. I did not give you permission to go over there. Oh, no. That's the only thing I don't like. It's basically like inverted commas. So to go up, like to move up, I don't know whether that's something I can change. I hope it is, because I don't like inversion at the best of times. And like, nobody should be using inverted controls. My friend does, the, the friend that was on the, that uh, got me started on the jigsaw puzzle. He, uh, he uses inversion. Um, and it freaks me out every time so anytime we play a game together the first thing both of us have to do is flick conversion <laughs> i mean we're getting better at saying like if you're doing this for me great but could you just put the inversion either on or off we did that a lot when um he was doing some of doom he was helping me out on doom a little bit the other day um because i got really really stuck in a particular place and then bless him he got me all the way up to where i needed to go and um as he went to go change back over for me um i was he left me stood on a platform so then as soon as i jumped back in the platform rescinded and i felt like i undid all his work but it was fine i learned by that point what i needed to do so but it was just like no it was very funny though But yeah, so when maybe on Monday, I'll I'll ask whether that's something people would like me to stream at some point, and maybe that might take over my weekend slot. Because I know I haven't necessarily picked the best game, a game that nobody's essentially heard of. That's <laughs> my weekend one. That's fine. I'll probably keep doing this myself. So I like games like this. As most of you will probably know. I could probably just put some like Twitch safe music on and leave it at that. You are an edge. And then once I've sorted out all the edges. We can start putting them in. Literally what my first hour of this is going to be. Is it? <laughs> Me just sorting out the freaking edges. <laughs> but then again, this is what you would do if you were actually doing a jigsaw. So... Points for uh, for uh, immersion. That's the word. I completely forgot the word immersion then. And I was like, the thing that makes it realistic to the thing if you were doing it. I may cheat still though and have the picture up. I don't know yet. I'll see how I get on. But yeah, I, I figured, you know, people people do artwork on there. And as somebody told me recently, my cross stitch is my version of art. It is following a pattern, obviously, but he was really sweet about it. Because I was telling him, you know, oh yeah, I have an old lady hobby. Oh, those two fit together. Nice, nice. And he was like, no, I, I wouldn't be able to do that myself. I don't have the patience for it. And it's very artistic. Which I was like, aww, you little sweetheart. Bless him. He's a good one.
Ah, wrong way. Inversion! <laughs> I have to remember the inversion. Inversion. I have a feeling this is going to get very complicated. I probably shouldn't have gone for 700 to start with, and I should have gone for a slightly smaller number. But that's fine. I like to go, I like to go straight in for a challenge with these. I like the music. Yeah, like I said, I was going to go Animal Crossing today, but the, uh, the the stuff wasn't changed over. And I was like, I'm too tired to be burying myself underneath my uh, computer screen, <laughs> trying to find the right cables and everything. And I was like, and I downloaded a bunch of different free games. I was like, I, should, I need, just need to do it. I just need to use it. Because I downloaded them, and it would be a shame not to. I can't even begin to think of the chaos that would be if Isaac decided to play this. <laughs> oh, bless him. I love him. But patience is not his strong suit. Okay, looks like I kind of started on here. Although I don't actually think I did. Weird. That's fine. But yeah, I hope I hope all of your Sundays have been going well. Hopefully, you've been having a nice weekend. Monday soon comes round again. <laughs> I also don't have anything Christmassy on today. I apologise for that, but um, Isaac had one of my uh, had my Christmas hat, and now I don't know where it is. <laughs> In true Christmas style, he has lost my Christmas hat. Um, he had it at one point. I remember seeing him with it at one point, and it has just disappeared into the ether. So. Yeah, I don't know whether I'm ever getting that back. But that be the joys when you have the kitties. All your stuff disappears. I don't mind though. I know some people get really like, ooh, but. I find it really weird. I find things really strange at the moment um, in the sense of like people judging other people because they're judging them. It's really weird. So like um, I get it started off with um, basically people saying, you know, if you don't have a child, what is the purpose of you? Um, which is just like an asshole thing to say. And I know that there are people out there that are just like, I, I don't want kids. And I'm like, fair play to you. I have absolutely no commentary to make on that. You you do you. You don't want kids, don't have them. If you do want kids, have them. If you can. Um, if you want children and you can't have them, I'm, I, am, I am very, very sorry to hear that. And I hope that you find a way for you to get what you want. Um, through an alternative means, such as adoption, fostering, etc. Um, or even if you just decide to help others that are in a similar situation to you and provide a support group, which is always, always really cool. Um, and then there are people that are just like, I, I just, I don't want kids, children. And they're just happy to say, I don't want children. And then there are people who seem to be like so anti having a child that they become just as bad as the people that want them to have the child in the first place 
and I find it weird. I, I find it odd. Like, is it odd that someone's trying to force you to have a child when you don't want one? Absolutely. Is it equally bad that you are trying to isolate people because you don't want children? Yeah. I have a kid. Best thing I ever did. I wouldn't force anyone to have a kid, but to equally make, I wouldn't say anybody is not, <laughs> yeah, uh, I wouldn't equally say that um, somebody isn't fulfilling a life purpose by not having a child. Children aren't for everyone. Depending on the day, children sometimes aren't for me. Um, but to make out, like, calling me a breeder... I've heard people just go, oh my god, you're a breeder, are you? I'm like, no, I had a kid. I, I'm a mum. This is what I wanted to do. I, oh my god, I can't believe that you would be a breeder. What? I wanted a child, and therefore I had a child. You don't want a child, and therefore you don't have a child. So, how, how right now are you being any better than the people that are calling you names for not having a kid by calling me names for having a kid? I don't know. I feel like, I feel like people just, they go so far in trying to be different that they kind of just end up being the same. And it's like, you do you, I do me. You don't want kids, don't have kids. I want kids, I have kids. Done. This needs to be a big thing. Like you don't, you don't need to, need to make a drama out of it. You don't need to make a big song and dance about it. If I start being an asshole about it, then by all means, tell me I'm an asshole. But just basically saying hi and like all oh, the first time you've met me and just going, oh my god, you're a breeder because you've had kids. It's like, well. You don't really know a lot about me. <laughs> it's a little bit of an asshole thing just to decide that I'm a terrible person because I had a kid. The same way that I'm not going to jump on and presume that you're a horrible person because you didn't. Oh no, where did that go? Ah. Oh, it's that up. I feel like sometimes like people just go so far left that they go right. And it's like, that's just, just, just weird. I was like, just, just, just don't, just don't judge people. Just let everybody live the life that they want to live. Is that really so difficult? I feel like it is. <laughs> I, feel, I feel like that's kind of the thing that we've got to now, like... It is so difficult for people to just exist without somebody calling the cops on them or just generally being an asshole. And it's like, do you not get tired? I get tired. I get so tired if that, I mean, I get tired anyway, but you know, if that, if that was it, if that was literally my life was only trying to make other people miserable because they had different choices to me. It'd be so tired. Like that that just doesn't sound like a good life to me. Maybe I'm weird in that. I just want people to do that. <laughs> you're not a brood bear. Exactly. That's the thing. Like, when, when somebody starts and they're like, oh, you're a breeder. And I'm like... Oh. <laughs> like, where does that terminology even come from? How do you not get that actually that's ruder than probably anything anyone would have said to you? Yay. People just be weird, man. People just be strange. I don't get it. I don't get people. 
This is why I'm an introvert. <laughs> Because I just, I don't get people. No. I just do not get the peoples. The peoples do the strangeness to me. Like I'm missing something here. I do also find it quite funny. Um, and it, it started off like I first became aware of this through um, a fellow person that I watch on uh, who video games. And she is an amazingly funny person. Like she is, she's she's freaking hilarious. Um, and she is, like me, a fellow mama. Yeah, there we go. So yeah, like me, she is a mom. Um. And she's into a lot of, um, obviously she plays a lot of video games, and she played a lot of, um, when it came out, oh, what's it called? The really difficult one. Yeah, that. Playing with fire. Um, oh, what's it called? Uh, Dark Souls. And um, she is... I am definitely missing one somewhere, aren't I? Yes, that goes there. That goes there. So yeah, she she played an awful lot of uh, of Dark Souls, and she was and she's very very good at Dark Souls. Like she's tremendously good at it. And uh, she has a little girl, and she uploaded to her TikTok. Um, some of the scenes of her playing it and the amount of stick that she got for allowing her daughter to very briefly look at Dark Souls was hilarious um, and it was like oh my god you are a terrible mother for allowing your your child to see this very brief clip of uh, of this game and she was kind of sat there like what <laughs> like really this is what makes me the bad mother the fact that i let my kid watch about three seconds of something that she's genuinely not terrified of but no, she was the she was the worst mother ever. How could she even dream of of letting her her sweet baby girl look at this terrifying thing? And it's like, oh my god! But then a guy did the same thing. He was playing Dark Souls um, with his I want to say son. And everybody was like, oh my god, you're making so many wonderful memories with him. Like, you're such a good dad. And I was like, oh, okay, I see. So he's a great dad for introducing his kids, his kid to Dark Souls. But she's the worst mother ever for introducing her daughter to Dark Souls. Cool. Okay. <laughs> I can make it make sense. There we go. There we go. There we go. You go on there. Do you go on there? And then do you go in there? 
Yay! We've got the edges down. Well, two of them. I'm missing one somewhere, though. I'm going to have to look for that because that's going to bug me. Um, but yeah, I uh, absolutely found it hilarious how... Can you help me turn Christmas mm -hmm. on? I was like, it made, it made, uh, yeah, it was just absolutely hilarious how she was the worst mother ever, but he was the best dad ever for doing exactly the same thing. <laughs> I was like, huh, hang on a minute. Well, at least it didn't take me the entire, like, <laughs> it was a little bit better, because I thought it was literally going to take me, like, the full first hour just to sort all the, uh, <laughs> the pieces out. I haven't quite got to that part yet, so that's, that's pretty... Yeah, I think you go in there, don't you? Yeah, yeah. Look at that. Beautiful. That's a nice one. Why doesn't mine look like that? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I've been watching too much. Well, I say that. That that. Yeah. Anytime anyone. Says anything remotely similar to why does it matter? Like it always that's a nice takes. Thing. <laughs> yeah, that's a nice thing. It always takes me back to that specific scene in The Simpsons. Yeah. Okay, yeah, it's fine. Here we go. Oh. My bag. I feel like you are in that corner. Have I missed a... Have I missed another one? Okay, you go there. Ah! Stay there! Stay! Um, nice, nice. You? No. You? Yes, nice, nice. <coughs> Must be you. Nice. You? No. You? Yes. You? Yes. I'm missing another one. God damn it. Okay, let's have a look. Oh. Inversion. I'm guessing it'll be. I mean, I may just kind of naturally find it as I keep going around, I suppose. Nah, no. I thought that was a corner piece. It wasn't. How is it that I've somehow managed to make this easier for myself? And yet not at the same time. <laughs> God damn it. Ah, there. Oh, I've dropped it again. There you go. There it is. Nice. Okay, maybe I'll... I'll I mean, I'm not going to, but maybe I'll find it later. Nice. 
<laughs> sick. Somehow I'm managing, I manage, I keep managing to get pears, but never in the right place. <laughs> but also not at the same time. I don't know how that's possible. I'm loving the fact that it's possible. Okay, I'm guessing you go there, yeah. You, no. You, no. You, okay. You, you. Uh, you, no. You, no. You, no. You, no. You, yes. You, no. You, no. Yes. Yes. You go on the top. Ha uh ha -huh, ha, I get it. Ow. <laughs> I'm missing one on the side. Got that. Okay. Um... So that all kind of goes in together. Oh, I guess let's try and get her hair. Oh, but it's actually really difficult to know what's hair and what isn't. <laughs> oh, no. Maybe take the, maybe take the picture off. Just get the feeling I'm gonna try and focus more on the on that than anything. Okay, I tell you what, let me grab some of these pieces. Cause that kind of looks like it is her dress, is it doesn't it? So maybe if I get like the pieces of her dress together. Yes. We can we can probably do some of that. Doesn't all need to be in one go. I mean, it would be great if it was, but it doesn't need to be. Because then we can always kind of go. Because I kind of get the feeling that green is actually part of the machine. So I could maybe put like machine bits together down here. Yes, that's not a machine bit, but it fits. So I will take it. I will take the ring to Mordor. Yeah, look at that. Hey, look at us making bits. Because I imagine some of these are actually just going to be like little bits in the background. And you see what I mean, Locke? I get the feeling that that's kind of more like here. Ha ha ha. Yeah! Oh, look at that! And then that kind of looks like... Yeah, that's like here, isn't it? I'm trying to see where it lines up. Oh, my hat! Hat delivery! Like, how is that not there? <laughs> okay. That's fine. We'll, we'll, come, we'll come back to it. It's 
Alright, we'll come back to it. Because that green is that Yeah, that green's up here, look. 100% that's like there. Keep that up. Um, not there. Yeah, there. Look, that's like. I wonder whether it technically is like. Yeah, it looks like there's one in between, doesn't it? And that kind of looks like that would be down here somewhere. Like more like down here. Ah, there we go. Okay, that looks like a bit of a rear. Although that kind of looks too dark. Okay, we'll come back to that. We'll come back to it. Go. That's more like over here, isn't it? Okay, you are not over here. Any that don't have a lot of space, I'm trying to... Uh, there. Yes, there, there, there. Look at that. Cooking on gas, not that one. Um, that kind of looks like it would be... Around here somewhere. Can't tell where that's supposed to be. You are somewhere around there, but I just can't tell where. Okay, you are. Yes! So, yeah, that is definitely like. Yeah, I think. Yes. Look at that. Get in there. So you look like you would be all together. I'm not quite sure where that would be. Like a lot of these dark ones, it's like, all right, would you be here? Yes, there, you would be there. It's difficult to kind of tell. <laughs> Yeah. 
Oh, not that one. Some of these look like they're darker than what they actually are. That's probably a nose. So like I think a lot of this is probably like her hair. So potentially I could be able to put all this together. Is that her hair? Actually, that kind of looks like her ear, doesn't it? Oh no, if they've decided to give her face like a slightly orange tint, this is going to be awkward. Okay, no, that is genuinely her hair. This is, uh, <laughs> that's going to be fun if that's what they've decided to do. That's that's the one here. That little strip. Okay, well maybe the strip thing I can probably do. That's a little bit of a finger, is that about there? Yeah, that's about there. I don't know quite sure where it is. I think a lot of this is like, I don't know, like, <laughs> the more I look into it, the more I'm really not sure. I'm guessing that's supposed to be skin? there 
I seriously no idea what it is. It'll probably make more sense like when I've got a bit more of it sorted. But at the moment, it does not be making the sense to me. It does not be making the lickest of sense. You must fit around there somewhere. You don't fit on there. How? I felt sure that you'd fit on there. <laughs> okay, yeah, so you go there. And you somehow don't go there. As you do. You go there, though. You go around here, maybe? Nope. Ah, wait. Okay, you go there. I'm getting there, chat. I'm getting there. Slowly but surely. I'm getting there. And every time I feel like I'm getting so <laughs> The game reminds me that I have absolutely no bloody clue. I don't, I don't, I don't appreciate it, game. I don't. I don't appreciate it. No, okay. Thought for sure that you were gonna go somewhere around there, but apparently not. Top piece. Are you sure that doesn't fit? No. God damn it. You are definitely somewhere around here. But I don't know where, so you're gonna have to wait for a moment. <laughs> oh! Jesus. <laughs> okay, freaking jump scared by the dog. <laughs> Because he's just decided to do a big old heckin' sneeze and scare the pejeebus out of me. As one is wont to do. Hey, okay. Nice, nice. You? No, you're still a bit too high, aren't you? 
Yes, yes. I like it. Like it. I still don't know where this is, but I like it. I no longer like it. <laughs> no. Definitely kind of a little bit regret going for a full like 700 piece puzzle. Oh, I get the feeling that's... Is that part of her arm? Oh, that kind of makes sense, though. Or a hand or something over here. That mm, maybe is... Um, nothing to do with... Actually, nothing to do with this. get the feeling that's around the other side. That's definitely Clara hair. That is. That's probably not what I think it is. That's part of the green thing. Right, you go there. Awesome. You don't go on there as much as I would like to think you do. You don't actually go there. You may kind of be more around here.
I attempt to just kind of put like hair parts all together. I get the feeling that's a thing, but I might actually be. I might be wrong. That's a lot of to do with that, isn't it? That's probably around here somewhere. Find it in the corner if I can beat it yet. The two that I was missing. Should have really paid a bit more attention to the uh, starting image. scan for that so I've got two side pieces miss edges on that I says on there um, it probably will end up being on this side because I haven't been on this side all that much Ooh, I bet that's to do with our hair probably connect some dots nice oh awesome I love that
fights are better than nothing. I know this is steampunk, but Jesus. All of this looks basically the same. Like, none of this. <laughs> At all. I thought that was going to be a lot more helpful than it was. And it was not. Okay, so I'm going to put this over here. Put some, um... Taking stuff out. Still definitely to do with her hair though. I'm guessing the darker it is, the more likely it is to be nearer. Um. Okay, yeah, I'm kind of guessing that that one is there. Um, that's probably going to be somewhere like down here, isn't it? That's down there or something. Okay, so I've got like a big chunk of that. Is that supposed to be like there? Ah, it is part of her arm. Makes a bit more sense now. Okay, so maybe So what, let me get all the ones that kind of look vaguely skin colour-ish. Or at least some more that look vaguely skin colour-ish. Because I might...
So that's definitely like a hand. There we go. That's part of her up here. There you go. Doesn't go there. It kind of looks like what here, maybe? Yeah. <laughs> I thought so. Definitely part of her dress. I'm not quite sure where though. I like 
like that. Anything around here? Yeah. We have a little bit of a thing over here. So, not quite. None of them quite fit. Yeah. There we go. Where did you come from? Where did you go? Ah. Let me see. Yeah, I think that's definitely there. Yes, we're getting there. No, I just can't figure out where you go. Down here, maybe there. Um, 
There we go. Yes. Okay, definitely, definitely needed the thing for this. You kind of go there, don't you? There, yeah. Back to you. Yeah, that's fine. I'm not quite sure where you are. Oh. I think you are probably more like up here. About there for you. Um, and then you. Yes, yes. Ah, you go down there. Maybe I shall let you go. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Okay, we're doing well. Let's join that one together. Nice. It is all coming together, my dudes. Okay. But I think I am actually going to have to leave it there for today. We got a fair bit in. We got all the corner pieces, and we got all the we got a lot of her arm sorted. Um, and some of the the um the typewriter. But yeah, so I'm going to finish that one there. This is a lot of fun. I enjoyed this. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to stick my thanks for watching screen on. Um, but yes, I will be back tomorrow. Uh, ready to play some more. Um, maybe House Flipper. I'll see how I feel tomorrow. But until then, have a fantastic rest of your evening, day, whatever time zone you are in. And yeah, I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.